All right, hey everyone, Waterbot here, and welcome to Partisans 1941. It's a World War II real-time tactics game, same same vein as, I mean, honestly, Commandos would be the root game, but also more recently, Shadow Tactics, the Plates of the Shogun, and is that the grass sideways? It is. That's amusing. Uh, Shadow Tactics, the Blades of the Shogun, and Desperados 3, which I absolutely adored both of those games, so when Datalik approached me about doing a, a short sponsored series on this, I said absolutely yes, I love this kind of game. And I kind of wish there were more of them. Enemy and partisan health is very low. Every combat is a serious challenge. Dogs are very dangerous. Okay. At Scary dogs. At 4am on June the 22nd, 1941, the armed forces of Germany launched a surprise attack against the Soviet Union. The great patriotic war of the Soviet people against the fascist invaders began. In the first several months, the Soviet forces suffered devastating losses, fighting against a battle-hardened and ruthless enemy. The Red Army was forced to retreat. The invaders stormed their way forward, raising Soviet cities to the ground and burning down villages along the way. Minsk, Smolensk and Novgorod fell. The German Air Force bombed Kiev and Sevastopol. Threat loomed over Moscow and Leningrad. Thousands of Soviet soldiers were surrounded, trapped in salience. One of them was a commanding officer of a rifle company, Captain Zorin. During an attempt to break out of the encirclement, he was taken prisoner and shipped to the nearest Dulac. He was supposed to be transferred from the prisoner of war camp to an internment camp. Fully aware that this would be a one-way ticket for him and his comrades, Zorin began work on a breakout. But the Germans discovered his plans. Sind Sie es? Warum sind Sie so seltsam angezogen? Es hat etwas gedauert, bis wir diese zwei im Wald geschnappt haben, Herr Kommandant. Hauptmann Sorin. Captain Sorin. Mir wurde gesagt, I've been informed, dass Sie die Gefangenen zum Aufstand angestellt haben. That you put the prisoners up to a riot. What are you trying to do? Ihr Krieg ist vorbei. Your war is over. Soon it will be over for the Red Army too. I wouldn't be so sure. We'll be chasing you all the way back to Berlin before long. Wir werden euch schon bald zurück nach Berlin jagen. Unser Sieg ist gewiss. Our victory is all but certain. Neither Moscow nor Leningrad can hold out for more than two weeks. Was habt ihr dem Deutschen Reich schon entgegenzusetzen? You don't stand a chance against the might of Germany. We, Aryans, are born to rule the likes of you. All humans are born equal. For you, Hitler's filth. You are human. Ihr seid keine Menschen. Was für ein Schwachsinn. Bringt ihn nach draußen zur Exekution. So gut wie er liegt, Herr Kommandant. Not gonna lie, I really like listening to people speaking in foreign languages and reading the subs. There's something just kind of neat about it. Go ahead, you bastard. Shoot. There's 170 million of us. You can't shoot everyone. The alarm. The sergeant must have started the riot. I wish I were with them. Now I'll have to escape on my own. I can't even hold a rifle. My hands are tied. I'll try and sneak along the fence while the guards are looking. Wouldn't you be able to find, like, a knife? Calm down. All right. How do I move? This is how I move? All right. Uh, I guess I should probably pick up the question mark. Controlling your character. Yep. WSD move. E to rotate. It's pretty basic, pretty standard. Stealth mode. Character starts using stealth movement if they're close to an enemy. I do we even have an enemy? Oh. Well, this makes sense. Yeah, did the guy not have a bayonet? Yeah, weren't weren't bayonets still pretty common back in World War II? I don't remember them being as common. I know they kind of dropped off. Actually, did they drop off in after Vietnam? I think they were still common enough in Vietnam as a result of like bush warfare. Enemy vision cone, move a cursor over an enemy, right mouse button to see it. Okay, so I can highlight one dude, 
Maybe temporarily. Okay, they finally dropped off in Nam. If Vietnam was a different type of fight and makes sense. Un unfortunately, I was actually talking about this in Discord a couple days ago. That, especially as an American, my knowledge of... My knowledge of modern history pretty much caps out at, like, early World War One, And everything else past that point... Okay, they got quick saves. I love quick saves. Trying to play one of these games without quick saves sounds like just a fresh hell that I never want to be a part of. I know, I know there's a lot of people that are like, You must play uh, XCOM, full Iron Man, you make a mistake, you live with it. I think just Beagle Rush and Christopher Odd ruin the genre a little bit. Okay. You make noise when sprinting, so keep that in mind. This wasn't the plan. I mean, seems like we're fine, so it's no biggie. Using environment. You can use certain objects in your environment to hide from enemies. Use the cellar by clicking on it. Okay. Similar, similar vein. And... Okay, we've got this guy. So it doesn't look like the tall grasses obscure his vision in the slightest. But I was going to say, I have very limited knowledge of modern history past World War I. And I kind of wish we did. I mean, hell, I don't even think we really covered too much into the 1900s period. Because I learned a lot about the labor movement when I was younger. But I don't remember if I learned that from school. I'm pretty sure that was actually just pure independent study and curiosity. And nothing more. Halt euch auf! Durchsucht das Dorf und den Wald. Findet und erschießt die Flüchtigen. Es darf niemand entkommen. Zu Befehl. Soldaten, mitkommen. Yeah. Let's see. Your school taught right up to the World War II and then moved back the to area. Someone must have escaped. The enemy is near. So up to World War II and then back to Revolutionary. Never even got past the U.S. Civil War in school. They didn't even talk about the Civil War too much. It was mostly just that the Confederacy was bad and wanted slaves, but they never really got into the how, the why, or like a lot of the really deep reasons for it, which sucks a little bit because I spend most of my life learning about ancient history, which is cool, but not useful. Container looting. Go up, take all. Oh, interesting. So is this going to have more of a resource management system? What is this stuff? Information. What is this? Meat. Huh. Okay. So I might actually be able to customize my characters here. Item equipment. Press ID. Open your inventory. Equip your knife. Got it. Hey, his hands aren't tied anymore. Okay. Stealth killing. Stealthy takedowns allow you to quickly kill your target. However, your prey will resist for a short while, producing noise that could be heard by enemies. And hide enemy corpses using environmental objects to keep them from being found. The return of the murder bush? Take a break from life. Wait, did that guy not notice the fugitive that I just saved? Okay, one way or another. Uh, eh? How do I how do I pick up the corpse? They told me about this. There we go. All right, into the outhouse with you. Perfect. Okay, is this man coming back? No, he ain't. Careful now. Get this. Stealth moving, enemies can't see when you're moving through bushes. Hiding corpses. Enemies can't see a corpse in the bushes unless they walk into it. Okay, so they don't, the corpses don't immediately disappear in bushes. Noise in bushes. Moving through bushes creates noise that can cause nearby enemies to become suspicious. If you 
If your plan was to remain undetected, wait for the suspicion level to decrease before carrying on. Ah, so they can hear me walking through these. So here's a question. They called them... They said the fascists' prisoners are escaping. This might actually be full German made. Very real possibility that... That they're still limited... I. Uh, Gosh. Uh, speaking of kind of history and some other things, I know I know in Germany there are actually kind of odd laws. Odd laws. I, they kind of make sense within the context. But there, there are laws that specifically forbid them from having not Nazi, like the word Nazi, or Hitler, or like a couple other things included. Jumping over fences. You can jump over fences for low shortcuts. There we go. I jump over any of this, or do I go into the shed? Can I go into the shed? Oh, yeah. I sneak through the shed. Skill tree. Character gained a new level and a skill point. So there's RPG elements. Oh, I like this. They didn't really have it in Shadow Tactics or Desperados, and I understood why, but having a little bit of light character customization actually is quite nice. Okay, so what's he got? Knife throwing. Increase throwing. Huh. So we got knife throwing. Increased chance to hit with pistols. Reduce reload time. Lower stamina cost of running while in combat. Increases backpack slots. Allow you to inspire your partisans, increasing their hit chance, fire rate, and stamina. Chance to hit with rifles. Allow you to kill low rank enemies faster when in stealth. Win chance during melee fighting increased. Cover knowledge. You have the skill, your partisan will have a low effect on the global map activity success, success chances. Huh. So it might be a little bit more sandboxy, too. Let's start with just going melee. Or, no, I already have that blocked. You need to learn more skills. I see, so I can only get knife throwing. Everything else is limited. Does anyone know that the Nazis were originally their political party anyways? Yep. Group of enemies. Enemies traveling alone can be easily neutralized or distracted. Much harder if you meet a group of enemies. Try not to let them see you. Oh, I heard something. Where's the group? Where did the other guy already... already leave? Shh. Hello? Pick up the men? Pick up the men. Okay, there we go. How do we drop the man? Right click, there we go. So, unlike Desperados, the body does not just fuse into the bush and disappear forever. Ah. Ability distance. Some of your abilities can be used at a distance. Okay, so knife throw. Whoops. But yeah, the Nazis were originally a... The National Socialism Party, which is odd, because I don't really remember a whole lot of their policies being particularly socialist. But then again, I feel like socialism has kind of changed over the years. I do retrieve my knife, yes? He's going down. One down. Yes. Okay, good. Knight. This will come in handy. I see. Click on the symbol. Instead of the corpse. And now I understand. And this game makes a lot more sense. Yeah, they weren't socialist. Yeah, I didn't think so. They very much were were a, a fascist party even early on. Quiet. I don't want to get into too much of the direct history. Just because... While it is super fascinating, it is also... Definitely the kind don't of thing that, down. like... Got one. I'm not sure if it's the most entertaining, but it's really weird to read about this stuff, because I, over the years, you know, over most of my life, I've learned about a lot of this stuff. But then I go back and I think, man, I learned nothing. Let's just toss the body there. I think we're fine. I don't even see any enemies in the immediate area. Not having a mini-map is going to throw me off something fancy. A direct history is good and worth discussing. It's true. I wish I was more of an expert in it. Unfortunately, history was always my least favorite topic. Uh, 
Ah, it was socialism in the sense of government control of most industry. But that's the only real socialistic aspect. Oops. I think I'm good for a second. Let's read this while we're here. Unusual containers. You can find containers in unexpected forms in unexpected places. For example, collect the contents of the nearest pile of stones. Oh, hey. No. Alright, so get some rocks. Stone throwing is a simple and effective way to draw enemy attention. I like the fact that there's an inventory management to this. That's got some fun potential. Okay. So I want to go inventory, rock. Let's just leave. Can I steal their truck? No. Mildly tragic, but is what it is. Is it another partisan? Hey, come on. Get up. We've almost reached the forest. Oh, I can't. The wound is too much. Leave me, Sanic. Run. Run for your life before they see you with me. What do you mean, run? Are you out of your mind? You don't leave comrades behind. I can carry you. Stand down. I'll carry him. Captain, you're alive. I, I thought the fascists got to you. I'm fine, but it looks like you took a bullet. We'll find a safe place and dress your wounds. Pops has a dugout in the forest. The Germans won't find us there. How far out is it? We won't be able to carry him through the woodland and swamps. I didn't think of that. We can take him to Mikhailovo, to Uncle Vasya. He won't betray you. All right, take us there. Probably should have kept an eye out for any other resources as I went by, just to see if there was anything interesting. I didn't see much, but I should probably remember to just hold alt regularly. Is he feeling better? The medicine hasn't kicked in yet, but he's going to be all right. You have no idea how tough he is. A real Lesgaft man. A Lesgaft man? What's that? He's an athlete. A student at the University of Health and Sport in Leningrad. We'll spend the night here and leave in the morning. Sanek mentioned a dugout in the forest. It must be Trophims. He's a hunter? Yeah, I... <gasps> Yikes! Look! The Palitzai! They're looking for us! What are we going to do? You and the sergeant stay inside. I'll go and say hi. Hold on. There's a stash under that floorboard. Take the meds and the gun. You'd make a great conspirator. Wait here. Why do we have an American accent? You know, I'm not entirely sure. Okay, treatment. You can restore your HP with medicine by placing meds in the item slot. To fire your weapon, you need to equip it. Have ammunition, press R to reload your weapon. Bullets are stored in your character's backpack. Painkillers can help your characters heal from injuries while ignoring the pain. Alright, so it's not going to be quite as stealth related. We have work to do. There's going to be a fair bit of stealth. Uh, hand over Commander Zorin. What is this? Info. Ravda, 172, int, anesthetic, huh, painkillers help your characters heal from injuries while ignoring the pain, got it, alright, so let's take a look, I'm gonna turn this game up just by a smidge, it doesn't seem like there's much for ambient music, for better or worse, okay, so I see two dudes here, we could get into a shootout. Oh, I know Careful probably now. what I can do. Let's go inventory, grab the gun. They're 
pretty blind. Did I not equip the gun? Or... Ah! V. Okay, we've got... Oh. So, light cover shooting. Take a look at both of these. Not the best. Is there active pause? No. Well, time to find out if this is going to work out in my favor. Covers and shooting. Height and cover. When you're in cover, you're much, much less likely to be hit. Shoot. Because I'm going to have to be there to throw a knife at either of them. So, I guess let's just do this correctly. Uh, who has the bigger Fire. gun? Who knows? No stopping us. We won. Uh, what's the noise? Where's the commander? Outside, talking to the police. You're going to have to leave. The area is a swamp, and it's been raining hard. If you're going to get to the forest, the causeway is your only chance. The causeway is just outside the village. Take the backyards, but don't get spotted. Sanek will show you the rest of the way. <laughs> what about you? Aren't you coming with us? I'll only slow you down. Go. I'll see you when things settle. Thanks a ton, Uncle Vasya. We can't fight without firing a shot. Let's take some weapons from the fascists. I, it amuses me to no end that the kid's name is Sonic. I realize that that's probably an actual name, but as a lifelong Sonic the Hedgehog fan, there's a certain amount of goof. Is there anything in here? No, it doesn't look like it. There's a certain amount of goof involved with anybody that has a name even remotely close. Squad control. Okay. Select everyone. F1. And if I want to do specifics, then it's just one, two, or three. Got it. Am I going the right way? I think I'm going the right way. Man, what I wouldn't give to cross this game with I Iron Harvest. Or a game like this. Who are these Politsai, Sonic? They speak Russian, and they look pretty local. I can't believe that our people could sell out to the enemy. They're no longer our people. Traitors. That's what those Polizei are. Serving the Commandant for money. Some are worse than the Germans. What kind of person would turn to the fascists and bully their own people? Well, there's a couple of them over there. Let's ask them. Okay, you're right. Before we, before we go too far, let's level up. Pain toughens the spirit. Okay, so now we have... This guy has access to a, two skill skill points. So we can get cover knowledge, increases defense bonus when in cover, melee, chance to hit with SMGs, grenade throwing range. Interesting. There's also pistols, rifle, shotguns, SMG. I'm assuming he's just got a rifle. I want to be useful. Russian pe peasant, Russian... Okay, so... Every single one of these guys are Russians. Let's give him cover knowledge. And it looks like he likes SMGs. So they, they do have their own individual ones. Disguise. Allows you to move near an enemy without drawing a enemy attention. Ability stops when you do anything suspicious, such as using weapons or abilities. Cooldowns unavailable in combat. What else does he have? High fence climbing. He uses shotguns. First aid. Makes less move noise when moving. Okay. Well, one way or another, disguise is incredibly important, especially with distraction. Because distraction is incredible. And then I think I'm going to give him high fence climbing. I'm a busy man. Okay. Now, is he just extremely wounded? 
I think that's the case. But we don't have any more med meds, do we? No, we do. Okay. As good as new. Let's have him heal up. Oh boy. Clear for service. Right, that heals him a little bit more. Oh, left side specific skill trees for specific weapons. Is that the case? No. Time to act. No, I think it's just because I invested one point in here gives him one melee, or maybe it's EXP with each of those weapons. I don't think it's specific skill trees, because I can't click on them. So my assumption is the more you use a weapon, the better they're going to be, the better accuracy they get. Could be wrong. I'm sure the tutorials will pop up at some point. I like the tutorial for this game. It's fairly mild. Effective shooting. Different weapons have different effective ranges. To reach max efficiency, you may need to get closer to your enemy. Use cover to decrease the chance of being hit during combat. You can also loot corpses to find equipment after killing enemies. You have a task for me. Okay. Mm. Let's go. How do we know effective ranges? Five percent. Careful now. I guess we won't know until we get closer. Yeah. So it goes goes up the more this character gets close. We'll let them have it. Hmm. Is there an easy way to check? If I do information on this gun. Okay. Yep. Oh, well, and it's gone. Information. Max distance, 15. Effective distance, 4. four. Oh. He's got a double-barrel shotgun. Nothing serious. Whereas he's got a... He's got a full-on sniper. Okay. I'd love to have a machine gun company what do I do? instead. That's me. I can okay. do it. You have a task for me. So he is disguised. I hope they won't notice us. And dotted, uh, the dots in the aim line is the range no dots. I think that was actually just there was something in the way. Character is busy. Saving is not possible. Calm Interesting. Down. I want to be useful. Calm down. Death to this fascists. This is my kind of sport. Ceasefire. All right, so having the boy go up with a shotgun actually worked incredibly well. They had no idea he was there That's me. until he started shooting, and then they were too distracted, the guys that were shooting much faster That's me. than they were. My recon experience comes in handy. Okay, doesn't look like there's any other loot. That's handy. Okay. Eliminate the police near the house. Group combat. Controlling your group can be a challenge. Use hideouts to increase your character's chances of survival. Tactical mode slows time and allows you to coordinate everything your characters do. To activate or deactivate tactical mode, press spacebar. To get more information about a weapon's hit chance, hover your cursor over a target. The higher the chance to hit, the more filled the marker will be. Oh. When not in combat, you can hide in cover and enemies will not be able to see you. Use this to set up an ambush. Okay, please say, please say, please say. Let's look around for a second. Looks like there's some stuff over here that I should go for. During missions, you can find gray colored items. These items will be converted into resources after you exit the mission. You can spend your resources at the partisan's base. Ooh. We'll pull through. Staying alert. So. It looks like this is going to be a little less linear and a little bit more maybe XCOM. Which, if big, if true. 
I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm a big fan of how XCOM handled things. It was just a little long for me. And also, RNG got real mean often. Now, we could have the boy... Easy now. Ah, how the hell? Okay, question number one. Is anybody capable of seeing this man? There's a very real possibility... This guy is actually just not visible. Because this guy... No, no, he does turn. But he doesn't Calm turn down. often. Can we get over Careful here? Now. No. Maybe. That'd be a toughie. Actually, immediate question. Put this back in the backpack. Not getting caught here. Too far away. Let's have the boy hop over. I hope I won't get caught. Oh, and disguise I'll up. tread softly. I like how nobody questions this child walking around. Okay. So here's the question. Character is... Oh, character is busy. Okay, so if we go back in here... Calm down. If I give the kid a knife... Hmm? I'm curious if I can effectively have sneak and stabber. To the far right of the woods in the shade. Oh. I need to hide. Follow me. Well, screwed that one up. What's the button? One down. I guess I probably could have shot. I tried clicking on the boy, but that actually just made me move closer. Yeah, there's a kid there. Or something. A little more XCOM. Time to prepare yourself for a 99% chance to hit missing 200 times in a row. Look, I... You're right. For children. Okay, so we're back here. Balls. It's fine. I... I feel like I'm on a recon mission. I barely made it anywhere anyway. <laughs> Waiting. Time to wait. Oh, I'd love to have a machine hmm? gun company here instead. Okay. Should we hit... That's me. Pass the knife again. Because I know he's absolutely the knife guy. But I'm thinking that hmm? the boy might be able to sneak by and do some horrible things. But yeah, there's a child here. Let's go try talking to the child and see what happens. Us. Anything else? Not too much. Yeah, no way I'm sneaking past with these two dudes. Uh -huh. Get down. What next? Hey, I didn't put a Calm step down. wrong. Now what? Okay. Just I scared of the blitzy. Well, that sucks. Oh, character is busy. Saving not possible. So I cannot, I cannot quick save. Period. While he's in disguise mode, I will keep that in mind. That's a bit of a departure from what I'm used to, and it's probably going to screw me up something fierce at some point. No, go through the door. Oh, you can hold the door open or just open it. I can do it. Okay, I'll well, this is fine. Me. Trying to listen to that guy whistle. It almost sounded like the Star Wars theme for like two seconds. Okay. Can't quick save here. So let's look at this guy's range of vision for like two seconds here. Because he mostly looks to the right, but he sometimes will look to the left. Or is it 
super mechanically the same no matter what. It is mechanically the same no matter what. Nuts. Okay, you know what? We got gun. I can't I can't distract them. So that's out. I'd like to We've got crazy pants option where I throw rock to try and distract this guy and kill this one and drag the body out of the way. Otherwise, let's throw rock. Go here. He's going down. Buck knife. We'll it's teach them a lesson. Got to search the pockets. Cover me. Gotcha. It wasn't me. Okay. I hope they won't notice us. Shotgun rush. Are you kidding me? Reloaded. Gotcha. We won. Got him. Yeah. So enemies seem to be mostly focused on whoever is shooting at them. They will be far less likely to go for a character that is not um, that is not currently firing at them. So I can actually use the boy with his slower movement speed. Uh, let's see. Can I get this? Oh, I see. One more skill point. Well, he's currently using pistols. I can invest in that, but let's give them cover knowledge. That's universal. I have no idea which weapon I want want them to use. Mm. We'll let them have it. Calm down. Okay. Uh, do do? F one. Grab this. It's mine. Calm down. You have a task for me. Okay. Is that all? No. You have a task for me. Mm. We'll let Eggs. them have it. Any other loot? Yes. So if the characters are too Easy. far away from each other, I will not be able That's to loot me. them. So in that case, wait. Did I take Zorin's knife away? I swear I took his knife away, gave it to Sonic, and then we somehow knifed him anyway. What? <laughs> or, oh, maybe he has a knife separate. He's got a throwing knife, but he's also got... I... That might make sense. What do I do? Okay, anything else for me to grab in here? There's, uh... Old lady that we can try talking to, but I bet she's gonna say nothing. Yep. We get a little bit more loot. Doors are confusing. Reach the swamp. Yeah, it looks like that's the case. What do I do? We'll pull through. I feel bad. We've effectively just robbed this poor family here. Okay, attack from ambush. Use ambush tactics to destroy patrolling enemies. Take cover to gain an advantage. There's a suitable place in front of you now. Action in battle. You can change behavior mode during combat. If defensive mode is turned on, partisans won't shoot until an order is given. During defensive mode, partisans' chance to hit is decreased. Ah. Uh, pain toughens the spirit. Okay. So I don't see any bad boys. Oh. Quiet. Easy now. Pain toughens the spirit. Okay. Doesn't look like I've got any good spots for this guy. We can maybe put him up on the ridge. I can do it. Okay, but let's have let's have distraction yeah, child yeah. get up real close. Hey, thank you, Razor Eleven. Right? Yeah. God, it's like every every month. You resub, and then I totally forget. It's fine. Calm it down. is fine. But thank you for the, what is that, 13-month resub this time around. Huh? Oh, that's considered a, a theft. It's like playing hide-and-seek. Yes. 
Staying That's alert. interesting. Stealing from locals will reduce your squad morale. Tread lightly. Okay, so let's just wait for them to come back. Let's not steal anything. Where is morale listed? Effects. Low morale. Characters are in a depression. Hit chances decreased. Ability cooldowns are increased one and a half times. Oh, shoot. All right. That sucks. Oh, tread softly. Hmm? Okay. You two specifically. Not defensive mode. I'm on it. Shot Get the my revenge. We won. There we go. Ambush boy. I don't know if the ambush boy tactic is actually worth it. There's, there's absolutely my going to be a moment. Laid. That's me. Where we try and ambush a guy, and they're just going to turn around and shoot the boy in the face, and then I'm going to feel real dumb. Hmm? Until then, Calm down. grenades. Grenades deal area damage and allow you to neutralize groups of enemies at once. Oh, I'm going to hoard these like crazy for a while, and never mind, I might use them immediately. We got somebody to talk to over here, so let's do that first. What has got into people's heads, son? Not only are the Polypsi on the rampage, but they're also bullying people to join them. And right by the church, too. Oh, is nothing sacred to these people? I think that actually was a younger woman putting on an older lady voice. Careful now. Whoa. Okay, there's one dude in here. What do I do? I can do it. I'll tread softly. Unless I'm mistaken, there's actually a dude in this house that needs a good killing. And nobody can see him. Attack! Oh, this can't be good. Another one down! It wasn't me. That was the last okay. one. I guess that worked out. I should have had these guys within cover. Uh, apparently they heard him doing the knifing. Well, is what it is. Okay, so we can raid some of this stuff. Get lost. Calm down. Have one, grab the whole crew. What else we got here? Heard about you, you're doing a great job. How did you hear about us? Oh, owie. Calm down. Kidney damage. Damn. Oh, that's better. Okay, that doesn't fix his kidney damage. Like Woo! That's me. It's a little. That's a little bit of a concern. Hmm. Right, can we raid the rest That's of this me. place? We can. Those eggs are mine. Oh, look at this church. I wish I could actually zoom in more. I... Commander? Older style churches are actually really fascinating to me. Not necessarily because they're... Well, I'm not a particularly religious dude. But it's just cool to see, like, what people had back then. And a lot of art and architecture were exemplified, specifically uh, when it came to religion. You know, most most basic dwellings were kind of boring. And so, like, if you want to see pretty Get buildings, down. you really had to go to, like, one or two different things. Huh? 
And that's about it. I hope I won't get caught. All right. So let's take a look at this. We've got two men. Calm down. Huh? Ah, that's why they never picked me for recon. That's me. Quiet. Okay. So I think this guy's going to come by, and I might be able to huck a knife at him. As we do. I'm on it. Bullseye. That's me. They've seen us. My recon. Charge. This we is won. my kind of sport. That was weird. You have a task for me. Okay. Calm down. That... You know what? That worked out. That's me. I'm not sure how it worked out. I really miss being able to line up all of my shots with all of my characters simultaneously. That would be super nice if I could say like, okay, you throw the knife and then you stab the guy. But oh well. I hate sneaking around. All right, so let's take a look at this. This is messy, which is probably why we're supposed to have the grenade. Who's got the grenade? Commander. The boy's got the grenade. Give it to him. I'll tread softly. Okay, they definitely clump up over there, so I'm gonna have this guy go over. Me. Oh. Gotta stop with the hard drinking. Okay, interesting thing is, there's at least one or two guys that I could potentially knife here. If I wanted to. Okay, so let's let's wait for them to converge. What is the AOE on a grenade? Oh. Kill the bastards. How many more of you are there? Wow. I'm on down. Okay, so fun fact they'll notice if you threw a grenade. If they see a grenade. That actually makes a lot of sense. Oh, this spells trouble. Okay, Calm so I down. might want to take this a bit more seriously. Cause yeah, if they can if they can see the grenade and they come running. Quiet. Not as useful. So I'm gonna try and do. Is one of these guys comes inside this building. I think it was this guy. Chew on that, swine. They've seen us. What if they're still here? Interesting. My faithful's laid. It's like playing hide and seek. Huh? I feel like... This is where the grenades would be useful for, but these guys have a serious problem with stupid. Well, I, uh, that's fine. This wasn't the plan. Okay, so now we've only got a couple of guys. Now, Pretty sure. Let's save. Let's get it to fascists. Yeah, I was hoping I. I was hoping they wouldn't notice it. Like if I landed it behind the build uh, the barrels. But no, it looks like no matter what, they will. Oh, this can't be good. Stiff. 
What? Okay, so that super didn't work. Didn't I save before throwing the grenades? Grenades are for getting them out of cover. That would make sense. Follow me. But this is not the quick save that I quick saved. Let's go back here. Huh. Yeah, it's odd. For whatever reason, when I go to this quick save, we immediately start shooting at them. Maybe throw a rock, then a grenade. Ooh. I'm down for I'm down for some science here. Oh, this spells trouble. Find cover now. Okay. I'm on it. This wasn't the plan. Quiet. Well, they, they didn't even I notice him that time. Gun company here we'll Scout. teach them a lesson. Going Never mind. They can probably see you through the window. They can inconsistently see me through the window. Kill the bastards. What? Well. Not a quick save, but for all right. Oh wait, wait. When you reload, you auto stand. Oh, is that it? Awkward. Okay, I can keep that in mind. Okay. Uh, a nasty wound. Well, let's try this again. I'm on it. Find cover now. Ah, stiff. Gotta search the pockets. Fire! Getting around. Oh, this spells trouble. Okay. So I think I'm getting it. Sort of. I'm trying to be trickier than I am. Sometimes they notice me and sometimes oh, this spells trouble. They don't, don't let me slightest. down. They found me. What if they're okay. still here? Gonna go knife. Attack. This is my kind of sport. What? No! What? Why? <laughs> he dropped the grenade at his feet. Why would he do that? <laughs> okay. Uh. I was really hoping I could just leave like a cooked grenade right at the door. He's going down. They've seen us. What the hell's that? Kill the bastards. Bail. Yeah, so the problem I'm running into here is the rest of these guys are not in an actually good spot. So, well, I think this idea has merit. I think no matter what, I'm just hurting. I'm just going to hurt myself and it's not actually going to be worth it. I think we're better off just getting in cover, shooting at them, chucking... Oh now. my Power gosh. I can't click. We have to wait. Oh! Oh, this can't be good. When it says press any key to continue, I click... But I click in the center of the screen, which tells him to walk forward. That's why this keeps happening. Okay. I understand now. That's why we kept getting into combat when we did the reload. So I'm going to have him go the long way around. We're going to have this guy. We're just going to go for a, a basic gunfight. Ah, how the hell? Let's see. I hope we're not getting. I can do it. All right, child. Uh, Try you know what? Me. Actually, let's let's get him to the other side of the the wood pile. Calm down.
Yeah, I wish I could knife toss either of these guys. Hopefully at some point we get the ability to... <laughs> oh, this is goofy. There we go. Hopefully we get the ability to knife toss considerably further. All right, we've got... Calm down. Plenty of ammo. Uh... You have what? a task for me. Have the boy start. Watch out to find another score. Oh, it hurts. Getting around. That bullet. Okay, I'm you go for that guy. Sport. There we go. Reloading. Going around we like that. There we go. My Got it. Experience comes in Not bad. Plenty of ammo. Now, do we have to worry about a distributing ammo to the other characters? We might, actually. Huh? Ow. Too far away. You have a task Everybody for me. group up. Yeah, see, that that actually works. Trying to be tricksy? Not so, not so effective. Trying to actually do it correctly? Yeah. Okay, so he uses regular bullets. He uses shotgun slugs. He uses those. Uh? Okay, sort items. A. It's neat that we're getting a lot of just random crafting component. Crafting components? I guess they're crafting components. Oh, and we have we have limitations. All right. Well, is there anything in this specific area that I can grab? Nope. Here. Easy now. Nope. What do I do? That's a robbery. More blood I want to be useful. That's still a robbery. Kid, you are plenty useful. You are a demon with that shotgun. What happens if you give him two knives? I know we have an upgrade later that lets me throw more knives. So I think that's the current limitation. Okay, place all your all your characters on the exit and you're good to go. Cool. I think I cleared this place out. Yeah, I think we're I think we're golden. Nope, not quite. They found me. Huh? Uh, let's see. Any other cover spots? The answer is solid. No. All right. Kill the boss and another score. One down. I wonder if when the kid is. In combat, can he disguise self? Probably no, not. Okay, so let's take a look at skill trees. Can I give him... That's quiet. First aid. Extra shotgun range. I'm going to give him cover knowledge. Increases grenade throwing range, decreases time before explosion. Okay, so let's actually give the grenade... Over to him. It doesn't look like we've got anything else. All right. Good to go. Let's get out of here. Rock seems like you can loot it. I think it was just a cover spot. Yeah. It's just a cover spot. Oh, right. Should loot these guys, though. Uh -huh. Yeah, it'll light up yellow if I can loot it. If it lights up white, that means I can just use it as a cover. As cover. Alright, and leave mission. I wonder if morale penalties drop. Like, if morale recovers between missions. Because it. <laughs> I, I don't think I would do it, but if I wanted to be an absolute monster, what I could do is rob the level at the very, very end. Oh, when combat begins, I'll disguise as end. Damn it. We're here. Pops is away hunting. He'll be back in a few days. This isn't a hunter's shelter. It's a partisan headquarters. Cool, eh? Built especially for our battalion. Got a dugout, a medical tent, and a storage room. Pretty much everything we need, and in a nice location. Let's take a look. I see you've arrived safely. I was afraid you'll get caught by the Germans along the way. We don't give up easily. They can never take us alive. What's new in the village? Nothing good. First came the Polizei. They combed the houses and took away everything of value. 
The Commandant for the squad finished what the Polizei started and wiped out the village. Have you decided your next missions? Are you staying here, or will you cross the front lines? How far are the front lines? <laughs> People say the Germans are already moving in on Leningrad. That's nonsense. I bet that's just a rumor spread by the Germans. Yeah, the Red Army never retreats. Shush. We'll take some time to settle and send out a scout. Let's find out what's cooking round here and go from there. Ah, now you're talking, comrade captain. In the meantime, I'll set up a workshop. We need somewhere to make us makeshift grenades and bandages. All right. And with that, that's actually a pretty good stopping point for the first episode. I know it went a little long, but I wanted to get a full proper mission in. I like the idea of this and I like the execution here. I really enjoy the fact that you can outfit the characters with different gear, knives, rocks, different guns, so on and so forth. I don't necessarily want it to be that in-depth of customization, but being able to specialize characters based on my own desires is kind of nice. And I like that there's a lot of familiar stuff too, you know, the disguising, the distractions, the stealth kill, the knife chuck. The knife chuck especially is super, super good, and I can't wait to show that off a little bit more. The camp management is interesting. It's very xcom -y, but I'm not sure if it necessarily fits in a game this short. Uh, but obviously, we'll see as we go further in. Anyway, uh, so before we go, thank you, Datalik, for sponsoring this video and the next couple of videos. This is super fun to get the chance to play. And I will gladly support any Commandos S game uh, that is good. And this one is. So, I guess with all that said, if you guys like this episode in any way, shape, or form, leave me a like helps more than you know and if you want to see more hit subscribe because i love this genre and i enjoy this game and we got a couple more in the in the lineup before i'm done so with all that said thanks for watching i'll see you next time